Welcome back to Kiko Flight Tutorial YouTube channel. And in this video, I'm using a different aircraft. I'm using the Coronado Cessna 152. And in this aircraft, I'll be demonstrating how to do slow flight. And what is it for? Slow flight is basically um, you basically slow your airplane enough, so slow your airplane so that you only above your stall speed around 5 knots to 10 knots above your stall speed and this is used um, like for example if you have traffic in front of you and you're going uh, and you're too close you want to do slow flight so that you can make space for the traffic in front of you and ha be separated and be a safe distance separated from each other uh, I'll be demonstrating this just in a few. I'm trying to get a bug. Let's look outside for a little bit. There's Republic Airport over there. Yeah. All right, let's start demonstrating. This. There's the inner shoreline. Oh, before I demonstrate, I want to tell you guys something. Um, when I record, I don't know what was wrong with this, but it seems like I'm lagging. Well, believe me, I'm not. I'm getting right now. I'm getting 20 plus nine in the 90s. Look, I have to open up fraps to demonstrate, but I'm definitely not lagging. I'm getting a look at that very high frame rate. Uh, I'm going to find a way to fix that for you guys. Alright. We're going to do slow flight and we're not going to lose. We're not going to go below 2,600 feet. And let's start. First things first, let's set four flaps. Alright, we're going to set power back. Around 1500. Remember, um, I, I didn't mention this. We're gonna pitch for airspeed, and we're gonna add power for, um, for elevation to maintain altitude. So right now we're losing altitude. We're gonna add power. We're gonna pitch for around 40 knots. There you have it, look. We're in slow flight. We're going to maintain heading, maintain altitude, and we're going to maintain a speed of 40 knots. So that from the outside. The airplane is in a nose high um, configuration, but we're not climbing. So notice, just because you have your nose up, doesn't mean that you're going that you're necessarily climbing. There you have the store warning. I'll bring the nose down to to get some gain some airspeed. Add power. We went below two thousand six hundred, so we're gonna add power. Yeah, we're adding power to gain altitude. And we have no up because we wanna we we pitching for airspeed. Hold on, I'm gonna mute team speak. Hold on. Okay, I'm back. I muted team speak. Alright, so now we're gonna exit slow flight. And this is how we're gonna do First things first, we'll start bringing the nose down. And power. We're gonna gain some airspeed. Bring flaps up. Flaps 20 degrees.
That's 10 degrees. And flat foot. And we maintain just around 2,600 feet. And that's how you do slow flight. I'll bring you guys a, uh, another video on slow flight during the traffic pattern. I think I'll do this after this. And during the downward leg in the traffic pattern. And I'll show you the way it works. Thanks for watching. And hope this has been helpful. For those who didn't know how to do slow flight. And there you have it. Peace.